Okay, so I finally decided to descale my Oscar. Uh, as you can see, it says uh, my espresso machine says Karimali uh, on the front, but it's uh, it's it's precisely the same as an Oscar's, the Nuovo Simonelli Oscar. Um, I bought it used and have used it uh, for a couple of months, and I absolutely love the thing, but. I decided to descale it after reading about uh, how to do it without disassembling the whole machine. It's actually quite easy. Um, I couldn't find any videos on YouTube on how to do this, so I decided to give a little back to all the uh, YouTube users who I've enjoyed watching, making videos about their espresso machines and coffee and such. But okay, um, unfortunately. I already started but um, decided to make this video so I'm gonna do it in a, a bit of a reversed order maybe but here we go so the f the first thing you need to do is to empty the boiler boiler and I'm gonna show you that in the uh, in a little bit how to do that basically all you do is you heat up the boiler so it has pressure and then you just uh, tip it on the side and uh, empty it out into the to your washer or whatever. A, a good idea would be to unscrew the steam tip so that um, the water has uh, is it's easier to uh, get the water out. So after you empty the boiler, what you do is you just add. Uh, I have just a simple. Um, this is a descaling. Um, it's uh, I don't know what the what it's called in English, but it's um, lemon acid, citrus acid based. It, it it's a non-smelling um, descaling solution, which is uh, which you mix with water in the appropriate amount amount. And after you empty the boiler f uh, for water, you just add the descaling solution and let and turn on the machine again, and it uh, let it fill up the boiler and then let it heat up which is what it's doing right now uh, hopefully it's taking a while but hopefully in a little while it's gonna start to spurt out uh, a little steam here um, then you turn off the machine put it on the side which I'm gonna show you and then empty out the water and I'm not sure I mean depending on how how much it needs descaling you can do you can add the descaling solutions uh, several times until you feel like it's enough and after that you just um, flush it with water the same way clean water uh, I don't know maybe two or three times um, and and that's it but um, I'm gonna cut now and I'm gonna return when I have pressure and uh, it's ready and I'm ready to empty the boiler Okay, so you see now um, it's starting to have pressure, it's starting to blow out water and steam. So I'm gonna let it heat up uh, just a little bit more, and then I'm gonna. I think, that's, I think that's good, so I'm gonna turn off the steam. And I'm just gonna let it heat, uh, heat until the um, the light, the heating light turns off, and uh, then I'm gonna turn it on its side. Okay, so I've just turned on the machine, and um, I decided to empty the boiler into a pitcher, a clear pitcher, so I can see how the water looks like. So let me just empty, uh, open the steam and steam one. I don't know if you can see it, but it's burning out a lot of water. I'm gonna open it a bit more. Wow, that's hot. You can see it filling up with water. Ah, have to be careful because this is really hot. And 
I'm gonna be back when uh, it's done. Alright guys, so I emptied out the water and take a look at this. It's uh, it's green, all green, and can you, I don't know if you can see that at the bottom. It's filled with uh, with filth gravel, and you can see it in the the sink. But that water looks nasty. So I think uh, I'm gonna give it another run through of the descaling solutions. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna. Uh, turn off the steam knob and just uh, turn on the machine and it should uh, and I filled up the uh, the water tank with um, another set of water and descalant and it should start uh, filling the boiler in just a second and I'm gonna get rid of this nasty water And I um, don't think I would like to breathe the fumes from that. Thank you very much. And here we go. Now it's filling the boiler. And probably can't see it here, but it's 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 uh, it's you can actually see it sucking in the water. And make sure you fill the water tank because it's pretty much going to drain the whole water tank to fill the boiler. So I'm going to give it a, another couple of runs and another run with um, descaling and then I think I'm going to run clean water through it uh, like three times until or until, until the water is, uh, is clear. Okay so the last, um, the third uh, run through of uh, clear water and it's looking uh, as you can see it's looking pretty good pretty clear so I'm just gonna I just filled it up and again and I'm gonna make myself a, a much needed uh, latte and there was one thing I actually forgot though to do I forgot to flush some water through the brew head to, uh, some water with uh, descalant in it uh, well I guess that will be for next time but you can do that if you want to descale the, I don't know, the piping or whatever. So, but uh, I guess that's it. And um, I hope you learned a bit. In the, in the beginning, I was uh, nervous because I read that uh, you can't descale a, a machine like this without, uh, you know, tearing the whole thing and apart. And uh, this was actually pretty easy. So, if you think uh, I did something wrong or you have any negative or positive uh, feedback then please let me know thanks